For some reason, men are convinced that women don't have partners before they get with the person that they end up marrying. And every man that a woman is with before they end up with the man that she's going to do with the rest of their life is like, no, I'm not this. If a woman has slept with one and a half men, then we cannot be because that many men is crazy. That's too much. Se That's why I had to do a video to explain to a lot of people that think the body count of anybody is too high for somebody. Makes no sense. Example, according to a census done this year, 2023, the average American will sleep with 7.2 people. I don't know where you get that point two from. I guess if you include pillows and dildos and things. Anyways, they will sleep with 7.2 people in the span of their life, 7.2. So before you get to your spouse, Somebody has laid him or her down six times. Six. Six individuals. Six times before. Remember, six. Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, and Saturday, your spouse has been with somebody other than you before they met you. But wait, there's more. A study done in 2017 around the world said that the average person would like to be intimate with their spouse 54 times a year. That's once a week. So if you want, if you want to do some multiplication, I'm going to help you do it. So if you go 50 times, we're going to lower 50 times 7. That's 350 times that a person has had intercourse. But then a person in their 20s wants to do it 80 times a week. So you go 80 times 70. That's 550, no, 540 times. So that means the person person that you are with, that you love to death, has been intimate with somebody other than you 540 different times. Missionary, doggy style, 69, 68, on a period, musty sex, gym sex, car sex, hotel sex, oral ain't even included in none of this. And let's not talk about anal. For a person to be judged because of their body count is insane to me because intimacy is supposed to happen because it's a natural occurrence and people want to feel closer and some people just like to have sex with other people. If you're a woman and you've been with multiple men and you're ashamed of it, you should no longer be ashamed because men, we get celebrated for conquering women. And then we reach an age where they say, you've been with too many women. That has nothing to do with you. If I bring you a clean and healthy instrument, accept that, that I'm clean, I'm safe, and I am healthy. The body shaming, the body number shaming should stop in 2023 because kissing is the new and is the new hugging and hugging is the new i don't just hug anybody because we transfer energies i'll give you some though but i ain't gonna hug you